This is copper pipe. For years, it was a standard to run water in a house. And it is incredible. The only thing that's been around longer is probably lead, which of course you can't use anymore because it's been banned since 1986 and will poison your water. But this stuff, you know, it's nice. It's gorgeous, it lasts forever. The problem with it is it's really, really expensive. And it's kind of a hard to install. You have to be a pretty advanced guy or you know, professional plumber to install it. it takes tools, it takes training, uh, it's slow going. So it's, it's kind of hard to install. But it was the standard until maybe 1960s-ish when somebody came up with this. And this is C PVC. And maybe you've heard of PVC, it's that white stuff you usually see out in like irrigation. It's very similar to that, except it's a little more yellow. Kind of looks like a faded PVC. And this stuff in the 60s took off. It's cheap, it's easy to install. It became the star of the day. But after a few years, <laughs> it started to become a problem. It's brittle would fail <laughs> and had harmful chemicals. So turns out it wasn't really that much of a superstar. So in the 80s, a new guy came around. That's PB and it became the star. But just like CPVC, it would get brittle and cracked too. And it actually is banned. 1995, they banned it. Can't use it residential plumbing anymore. So it went away. So in the 90s, this new star appeared in residential plumbing. It was called PEX. It's cross-linked HDPE. And it was the star. It took over everything. In fact, if you were to have your house plumbed right now by a plumber, this is what they'd use. I know because I had two of my houses plumbed and this is what they use. And it comes in all sorts of different colors. You got blue for cold. You got red for hot. You have white if you don't want to have red or blue in your house. In fact, uh, when I had my house replumbed, they use white. Looks beautiful. There's PEX A. There's PEX B. It's a wonderful, wonderful product. Easy to install. Really cheap. I mean, anybody can install it. In fact, if you add these guys, these are what's known as shark bites technical term is push to fit and they're called push to fit because you literally just push it on and then you can hook something else up to it. You can even hook copper up to it. Now of course this is three quarter inch and this is half inch so it's not gonna work but you could hook it right up to copper. It's easy easy to install, dirt cheap. Here's my question to you though. Is this stuff gonna go the way of PB and CPBC? In 20 years, we're going to start seeing failures or some weird thing come up? Let me know what you think. Let me know your experience. Have you installed this? Have you installed copper? Do you prefer copper? What do you guys use out there? Leave a comment below. I'd love to hear from you. And as always, subscribe and like this video. And I will see you next time. Thanks.